Cutting the 301s for Tesla. Some more 301s. It is Bowen, Portland Live. It's Friday. This is the crew. He's about to do 1.10. We about to do zero to 60 at 1.98 seconds. Cutting some more Tesla wheels. Yeah, you know. So, all right, like I said, today's Friday. Uh, we have an energy crisis in Kieran, California. From four to nine, we won't be uh, having any lights on here to help help out, you know, be considerate. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're gonna do another install video on the new G80, G82 M4. We're gonna replace this hideous thing with our new, oh, uh, you guys seen our carbon grill. We also have an ABS uh, grill. So here it is. So walk me, walk me through how this grill differentiates from the OEM grill. For one, it looks better. Definitely. <laughs> the front design on the, on the, on the G82 is, is, is definitely uh, yeah, I don't polarizing. It gave us an opportunity to make a better uh, version of it, so we came up with this. So it's the same look as the carbon grill, mm -hmm. just ABS, just made ABS. out of ABS, and finished in piano black finish. Paint it whatever color. But, but it's ready to go as it is out of the box. Out of the box, ready to go. Okay, cool. So walk, so walk me through, it looks like it retains most of the factory fitment and uh, options. Is yeah. that the case? So the, the shape is the same. Uh, we just got rid of, you know, like all the unnecessary plastic stuff and we yep. just opened it up, made it more lively. So what's this for? Of course, this still re retains the M badge. So, yes. Moving on to that. And then is this then, for the uh, camera? Is, so this is for the camera. Yep. And these are the sensor brackets. Yep. And if you can see in the back, the brackets are retains the clips. Yep. Right here. Sweet. So it's it's a complete like just just plug it in. Cool. Plug in, plug in. And then what is this this front lip? I'm like trying to like match it up here. Does this go? This must go under the bumper. This, this goes under the bumper. Yep. So, so that it, it holds so it, it stable. It, Yep, it maintains the uh, stability. The stability of it for sure. Okay, cool. So it bolts right up. Yeah, we're gonna have Eric show us how to install it. Yep. If you want to figure out more, check it out on the website. Um, well, cool. Looking forward to having Eric install it. So this is the tool required for this installation. We need a quarter inch ratchet, quarter inch eight millimeter socket, tool pick, long extension, and a T30. Start doing it by So we have this plastic piece covered. So we have this factory mounting point. All these out of the court, out of the port. All these factory mounting points. Take this part out. We have these bolts here, T30 attached to the bumper. So it's gonna be this one. We have these two 8 millimeter bolts here. We have this connector, sensor connector. We have another connector here. Uh, it's sensor and one more. So we have three total connectors here to take this one out. We have this 10 millimeter bolt for the bumper. Parking sensor. That's the parking sensor? Yes, right here, this one. Okay. Unplug the parking right sensor. Here. Okay. Just like push it in.
Good. So the next step is going to be removing the sensor connectors, this one and this one, and transfer to the uh, On a scale of 1 to 10, difficulty 10 being the most difficult, what, what do you say this is? 6, 7. Next step is going to be transfer the OEM sensor to the new port. So just do it on the right way. Just make sure you put it the driver side on the driver side and the passenger side on the passenger side. So safely remove the sensor the OEM. So we got the bumper off. Uh, didn't seem that hard from, from my observation. And now we got Eric over here working on uh, putting the mesh on the grill. Now the mesh is, is optional. Uh, you don't have to have it. We sell these separately. It's good. Uh, just make sure the hardener is back to the uh, original position. All right, so before we install the bumper back onto the car, I just want to point out one thing here. So right now this is our grill. Uh, what we're going to do is see where these sensors, sensors are at. So ours sits a little bit in a, a higher position than the factory one. So, in, so instead of removing the entire safety foam off, um, kind of don't want to do that for obviously safety purposes. So what we're going to do is we're going to shave off a little piece right here off the bumper. Uh, it? Probably maybe about like two inches off of it so it can fit. All right guys, so here it is, the new BMW M4 with our ABS plastic uh, front grille with mesh. And you know, this is my first time actually seeing this on the car and it came out a lot better than I thought. It's really good, really clean. Gives it that nice aggressive yet classy look. Hope you guys enjoyed this segment of uh, how to install. So if you guys like what you see, give us a like. If you have any suggestions, give us a comment below and we'll see you later.